Obviously, you don't. A regretful miscalculation. You bypassed the pinnacle of pre war security systems. I can see you're no common criminal. Perhaps we can reason this out. Let us discuss this amicably. Who are you? Don't you think it's time you ditched that mask? You're. You're right. I'm no match for the Silver Shroud. I'm... Isabel. The Mechanist was just an easy way for me to help the Commonwealth. But all my technical knowledge and all of these resources and... I still failed. How does the Commonwealth have any hope against people like you? Again, you cast me as the villain? Ha! But it is you with your rampaging robots! They have taken innocent lives. My friends, they were simple traitors. All dead at the hands of your robots. No, that can't be right. The robots are programmed to protect. Their subroutines are clean. Observe, evaluate, and react accordingly. The testing was thorough. I ran every scenario. All passed. The blood of innocence was spilled. Your own lackey confessed. Her twisted logic leading to tragedy. Saving by... killing? No. It's... the logic. It's there. I can see it now. I was hoping it was the robo-brains, an issue with their memory wipes. Right. <laughs> Their primary directive was flawed. So, the veil is lifted, and the truth revealed. Your technological hubris is to blame. I want to help the Commonwealth. And robots are all I know. I found this place, and figured I could finally do my part. I accept full responsibility. I can't take back what I've done, or even atone for it. But this doesn't have to end in violence. Though your action initially appeared felonious, your intent was not. Seek redemption, Mechanist. You have much to atone for. Done. Consider it done. And you won't regret this. I promise. None of the Commonwealth will. Here, take this. It's the password to the mainframe. You can use it to shut down the security protocols. I just... I'd rather this place be in your hands now. Quite a few impressive devices around here. Would you be disappointed to hear that I let her live? I do have conflicting outlooks, if that is the case. But I trust your judgment. If she lives, she does so with the guilt of what she's done. If I shut her down, the whole facility is under my control. So the desired result has been accomplished. Did she reveal her motives and reasoning? She truly wanted to help people. She didn't know what the robo-brains were doing. To her, a life saved was a life saved. A biological wild card. 
The unknowns are vast. She had to know the risk she was taking by creating them. Many good people endured suffering and death because of the Mechanist. It's a shame a mind as brilliant as hers allowed such atrocities to be committed. She's an idiot. She's lucky to be alive. I'm uncertain if my logic protocols could override my personality subroutines had the decision been in my hands. Still, I now know that the death of my friends has brought about a safer commonwealth. Had the Mechanist's robots remained unchecked, I'm certain that damage would have been extensive. Halting, if not reversing, any progress that has been made here. With this knowledge, I am finally registering feelings of satisfaction and accomplishment. And I have you to thank for it. Hey, just one more thing. Do you have a minute? What's up? Just a quick thing. I just wanted to say I'm really happy, thankful that you've let me stick around. In order to show you that I'm done with the past, I want you to have this as a sort of promise, I guess. It's the mechanist suit I made. You really don't want it anymore. No. It's part of a past I don't want to dwell on. It's time I move on. There's one more thing. A much bigger thing. There are still robots out there. Lots of them. My communications are down, and I can't call them back. But I can tell you where they are, if you're interested. Seriously? How many robots are out there? Quite a few. <laughs> There's a lot of ground to cover on the Commonwealth, so there's kind of a whole bunch out there. Sure. Great. Hold on. Yeah, tracking at least two bots. Oof, could be more. You should plan accordingly.